Hello everybody, Multiman37 back here with another review, this time of the Deluxe Mosa Changer and Mosa Blade from Kishiryu Sentai Ryu Sojourner. Now, I did get this mitten box, but I couldn't find the box. I spent hours and I w wound up being very exhausted. So, as always, I will put a picture of what the box looks like in the description um, for any of you that are here still, you know, curious as to what it looks like. Um, but, um, since we don't have a box, we'll just take a look at the Ryu Souls included. First, the two Ryu Souls that come with the Mosa Changer, and then the one that comes with the Mosa Blade. So here we have the gold Ryu Soul, and this is a change type Ryu Soul. Why isn't this focusing? There we go. Uh, yeah, mine ev ended up, uh... The, the clip that holds it in place got snapped off. Uh, you can kind of see it, it's very jagged. It lost its luster. And I am planning to buy a new changer just to get a new soul. Because um, this thing will not stay. Like, I can get it to stay. Um, but it takes a lot of effort. And I don't like that. But uh, regardless, when you do flip it up, see, I didn't even hit the button that time. There. Uh, when you do flip it up, you do get the helmet design for Ryuso Gold, a sort of jagged blade, and the emblem of uh, Mosa Rex, his Kishiryu partner. And you do get the face for his robot, uh, which I'm not going to show in Kishiryu Row. I'm going to wait for when I show off Mosa Rex. Then we have the Biri Biri Soul, which is a Cho Ryu Soul. Um, the, uh, as the Mara Mara Soul represented fire, this represents electricity. So uh, it is designed in the form of a Spinosaurus. Uh, more on that when I actually do review uh, Mosa Rex. Um, but it is done in very bright yellow. Why do you not focus? Got some lightning bolt details, even within the blue eye right there. Um, when you flip it up, you got an electrified sword, the emblem, the standard helmet, and unfortunately it doesn't have a stylized face. Again, more on that when I review Mosa Rex. And the one soul that comes with the Mosa Blade is the Mawari soul, which, is, which means spin. So there it is. It's got a little dizzy eye right there. It's done out in this kind of baby blue color um, for the paint. Flip it up and you get a little pinwheel. And the emblem and the back is the standard helmet. Now, this does make a unique sound in the Ryuso chamber, which I have right here. I forgot to remove the red Ryusol, but whatever. So it did do a transformation sound effect instead of a generic sound effect, but when you hit the button, You can straight up summon Mosa Rex. Um, if I didn't show off what the Cho Ryu Soul's doing here. That's sort of what they do. Because I'm not sure if I d did show that off or if I didn't. Um, but. All three of them do have a sound effect in the Ryuso Ken. And I do want to get the memorial version of this because it looks very cool, uh, but it's very expensive. So let's start off with gold. So I'll hold it down for the special sound effect.
feel like that would better dis uh, represent this old blue, but I guess they kind of screwed it up early on, whatever. And you do get an attack. Yeah, I covered up the eye, whatever. Next is the Beery Beery Soul. I like that. Love it when the camera glitches out. Uh, and then you get the armament sound effect. Finisher. And of course, we standard resoul the Mawari soul. Sort of spinning sound effect right there. Armament. And finisher. So there's that. Also, one more thing, you can get this as a double set, but again, I got this separately. So here we have the Mosa Changer, which is a gun designed to look like a Mosasaurus, which is a, a related species of that of the Plesiosaurus. Um, so very nice, done out in this kind of navy blue plastic. You got little bits of gold paint for the undersection and the bottom of the pommel, or the, not the pommel, the trigger. Uh, there's a little bit of silver underneath the fin and some white paint right there. Uh, the hammer does move, it is spring-loaded. Um, so yeah, not much that it does without any batter or batteries, obviously. Um, battery compartment right here, as always, two AAAs, which you need to provide, on-off switch, and the speaker, um, which I always forget where this speaker is on this thing. Um, I think it's somewhere, um, somewhere back here, I think, probably around the back. I always forget where the speaker is on this thing, but when you do turn it on, you get... So, you get its name. I just got a text message. Um, uh, by itself, you do get some shooting sound effects. Very standard. You can pull the head forward, and it does have a green metallic eye. Like that. So you can... Uh, mul uh, load this up to do a multi-shot. If you do it too much, you'll end up sneezing. The most I can never get him to hold is five before he starts sneezing. You do get the Resol logo right there. Um, or the Resolger logo right there. Yeah. Um... But let's get down to the transformation of Ryusou so Gold. So you stick the Ryusou, the Ryusou in the slot here. Hey, 
and then to initiate the standby, you twist the head so that the armored part is facing upward. Get a nice little standby. And then pull the trigger for the transformation. And there you have the transformation into Ryusoul Gold. Um, now, with the Ryusoul installed, you get a multi shot uh, 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 of an actual Gatling gun. Because this thing is actually made to be a Gatling gun. Actually, I think it might be a hybrid because I'm not sure about that centerpiece. Um, but after you run out of bullets, you're out and you reload by cocking the head. Actually, if you cock the head, I'm, not... uh, I'm gonna have fun editing this. So you can actually restart the transformation if you do this like a bunch of times. So if you want to get the transformation but not bother taking the reusal out, uh, then there is your option. Um, speaking of taking the reusal out, you pull back the hammer to actually release it, which is quite clever. And then, of course, you do get the Beery Beery Soul. Now, the way this works, there's no reader in here. Uh, do, the little, there is a little indent between the feet, which is not present on anything but the Cho Ryu Souls. So, if I put this in, it'll make a different sound, but on top of that, it will bring these together, which I have to flip in. So you cock it four times, just like you would open and close the jaw of the Russo can four times. And then you get the transformation for Russo Gold, Beery Beery Soul. Um, and then pulling the trigger, you'll get an, uh, an electric attack. Um, and this never runs out of ammo. So you can do that forever. But when you do try to reload, you get an exploding shot. So there's that. Now moving on to the Mosa Blade. Uh, done out in mostly this kind of pale gold sort of mustardy color. Uh, there is no on and off switch, so this will always stay on forever. Um... Got some black plastic there, uh, speaker right there. This does um, come with batteries, the, um, which just a little pull tab right there. Very weird contrast, but whatever. It is sort of a, it is sort of a sawtooth blade. Um, um, so that is nice. Uh, so no real way to turn this on, but you can get it to say its name when you hold the, down the trigger. We'll do a little explosion. So by itself, you get... Then when you pull this little lever, which can also turn for whatever reason, I guess depending on how you're holding it. So when you... Pull this. You get a chainsaw sound effect. And pulling the trigger will initiate a different attack. And pulling it enough times will get you that secret sound effect. Now when you put in a Ryu Soul, like the included Mawari Soul, a uh, little spot right there. What the hell? There. Go 
a little standby. So pulling it four times would do that, and then it's so very nice. Um, and Itadaki Mosa is a, a, a pun. It's Mosa and Itadakimasu, which is a way of saying thanks uh, at the dinner table. It, well, in Japan, anyway. Um, we'll release button. We'll take that out. Also, if you do leave this in, and just pull the trigger. Um, well, hold on. You have the same sound effect. And you do get a different sound effect when you hold down the trigger. Now, these two can combine. Uh, this is very only exclusive to when Riesel Gold is in a Cho Riesel armament. So in order to do that, um, you take the clip of the gun and attach it to this hole. There is a little peg and a little hole that will activate a different sound. Um, and to release it, you do just pull, uh, push these uh, to release it. And then when you attach them, you get the Mosa Breaker, which automatically does a standby. And when you fire it off, And this is a very decent size. I actually kind of liked how this turned out altogether. Um, now, when you do remove a Ryusol and try to put it back in, you'll get an error sound effect. And that will actually disengage um, automatically whatever was already in here. So, it's kind of back to doing standard sound effects. Oh. Yeah, that's a little glitch. For some reason, um, if you pull this enough times, you'll disengage the trigger. Only way I could ever get this to not um, to reverse itself, first I turned it on and off, which is obvious, but you can actually reactivate the trigger by just pulling the head back, which is a very weird glitch, but I don't know. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for these two. Overall, um, they are very nice to have together. And, um, if you either buy them in a set together or by themselves, uh, you won't be disappointed that much. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I will see you guys later. Take care.